Dave Callier is widely recognized for his role in the classic sitcom Full House. His portrayal of Joey Gladstone left a lasting impression on many viewers. He's known for his impeccable comedic timing and ability to bring laughter to audiences of all ages. His work on the show is cherished by fans around the world. One can't help but smile when recalling some of his most memorable moments on screen. If you have a favorite memory or personal experience related to his work, we'd love to hear it in the comments below. Stay tuned for some funny, shocking, and even sad facts about his career. Keep watching this video for more insights into his life and work. Dave Callier, known for his role as Joey Gladstone on the sitcom Full House, left a significant mark on the film industry. He influenced Hollywood mainly through his comedy skills and acting versatility. His portrayal of Joey Gladstone showed his talent in delivering humor effectively, which boosted the success of Full House. His sense of timing and style of humor influenced future comedians and actors. Collier's impact wasn't just on screen, he also contributed behind the scenes and lent his voice to various animated series, showcasing his adaptability. Moreover, his involvement in charity work outside of acting demonstrated his commitment to making a positive difference. His dedication inspired others in Hollywood to support meaningful causes. In summary, Dave Callier's influence on the film industry, both during his time and later, is evident through his comedy, acting skills, and charitable efforts. He remains a respected figure in Hollywood, remembered for his significant contributions to entertainment and philanthropy. Dave Callier played Joey Gladstone in Full House. He wore a University of Michigan hockey jersey in some episodes, which was a nod to his time at the university. On the show, he imitated many famous people like Bill Murray and Bob Hope. He also mimicked characters like Pee Wee Herman. Besides acting, he started a company called F3 Entertainment that focuses on kids' entertainment. Dave Callier's various talents and experiences have helped him stay successful in showbiz. This was Dave Callier, known for playing Joey Gladstone on Full House, was a big fan of the Detroit Tigers. In the show, he often wore Tigers jerseys and caps, showing how much he loved the baseball team. In 2003, he appeared on VH1's The Surreal Life for its third season, which aired in September 2004. This was a different kind of show for him, showing that he could do more than just sitcoms. Full House was a popular sitcom where Dave Callier played Joey Gladstone. He, along with John Stamos and Jody Sweeten, was in all 193 episodes, which shows his commitment to the show. Bob Saget missed the unaired pilot, and Candace Cameron Buer was only absent in one episode in the sixth season, called Subterranean Graduation Blues. Sometimes, Mary Kate or Ashley Olsen played Michelle in some episodes. His consistent presence in all Full House episodes shows how dedicated he was to the show and his character. These experiences helped him have a diverse career in entertainment. Dave Callier portrayed Joey Gladstone in Full House. In the show's first season, he, Bob Saget, and John Stamos went on a road trip to Las Vegas to bond. Stamos and Callier, who were both single, became close friends during this trip, while Saget, who was married, stayed back. Their friendship influenced how their characters interacted on the show. Saget also hosted America's Funniest Home Videos while Full House was on air, he later hosted America's Funniest People. During his time on Full House, Saget had a dog named Heckler who often joined him on set, bringing happiness to everyone there. The bond between Saget and his dog added another layer of warmth to the Full House family. These stories from behind the scenes help us understand why people still love the show. They show how the actors' real-life friendships help make the characters feel real. These experiences from both on and off camera continue to be important to audiences worldwide. Dave Callier, known for his role as Joey Gladstone in Full House, found himself in a unique position after the passing of Bob Saget on January 9, 2022. Alongside John Stamos, he became one of the surviving members of the older male cast from the show. In the film Dumb and Dumber 2, he was indirectly referenced when Harry mentions watching every episode of Full House to Lloyd. This was a playful nod to Jeff Daniels, as fans have often mistaken him for Dave Callier due to their resemblance. Currently, he hosts Animal Kidding on Animal Planet, a show he's been involved with since 2003. Dave Callier's roles in Full House and his ventures in hosting Animal Kidding showcase his versatility in the entertainment industry. In the television series Full House, Dave Callier played the role of Joey Gladstone. 
Throughout the show, he often displayed Detroit area sports merchandise, reflecting his own connection to the Detroit area. Memorabilia from Detroit sports teams like the Red Wings, Tigers, Pistons, and Lions adorned his character's wall. In a 2012 interview, he mentioned that while Joey would root for the Giants, he personally cheered for the Tigers during the World Series. Before landing the role of Joey Gladstone, other actors, including Jeff Daniels, were considered. However, the part ultimately went to Dave Callier, solidifying his association with the character. Aside from Full House, he also starred in the Nickelodeon film Shredderman Rules in 2007, showcasing his versatility beyond television. In summary, Dave Callier's portrayal of Joey Gladstone in Full House, with the character's Detroit sports affiliations and his triumph over other potential actors for the role, highlights his significant impact on the world of entertainment. He is a skilled musician, proficient in guitar, harmonica, and piano. He gained attention beyond his musical talents due to his brief relationship with Alanis Morissette in the early 1990s. They met at a celebrity hockey game. He hinted in a Twin Nate interview that he was the inspiration behind Morissette's song You Oughta Know, though Morissette hasn't confirmed this. His heritage is diverse, with his father being of Belgian Flemish, German, and Slavic descent, while his mother is of French-Canadian heritage. His mixed background contributes to his rich cultural identity. His musical abilities and personal history have added layers to his public persona, making him a noteworthy figure in the entertainment world. Dave Callier, known for his voiceover work, contributed to several beloved cartoons. He voiced characters on Scooby-Doo, Scrappy-Doo, and The Jetsons. Later, he showcased his talent in Muppet Babies, Embodying Animal, and Dr. Bunsen Honeydew, along with other characters like Waldorf, Statler, and Bean Bunny. Moreover, he lent his voice to Peter Venkman in The Real Ghostbusters. Often confused with actor Jeff Daniels, he humorously acknowledged their resemblance on Twitter. In Full House, he portrayed Joey Gladstone, drawing parallels to his own life as a struggling comedian, reminiscent of the character's living situation. Callier's career is marked by his versatile voice acting and memorable roles on screen. Dave Callier, known for his role as Joey Gladstone in Full House, is famous for his tagline, Come on now, cut it out. This catchphrase, along with his signature hand motions, originated on the Nickelodeon variety show Out of Control in 1985, predating his stint on Full House. In July 16, 2010, he showed his heroism when he rescued an elderly woman in Detroit, Michigan. While riding his bike, he saw the woman walking into oncoming traffic, almost getting hit by a moped. Without hesitation, he swiftly grabbed her and carried her to safety with one arm while pedaling his bicycle. During the shooting of Full House's eighth season, Callier encountered a minor accident that injured his right arm. Consequently, he had to adapt, using his left hand for most tasks until his right arm healed. His co-star, Scott Weinger, teased him about it, even suggesting that he become left-handed. 